I'm here with Batesford United manager Steve Chettle after his side's 2 0 win over Afton College. Steve, a crucial win before Christmas. Do you think the scoreline reflected the lads' performance? I think so. Yeah, I thought we were uh, good for a first half lead, to be fair. I thought we played pretty well. We didn't put the ball in the right areas at times for the first half. I thought second half we did it a little bit more effectively. Uh, we had to make a change. Obviously, Sean got injured first half, and Rev came on. Rev was very, very good when he came on. Uh, he showed what his strengths are, and he played to his strengths. And the second goal, even though it's an injury time, and they were chasing a little bit, but you know, killed the game off. It was a fantastic goal, but really, really pleased. And it's, it's been a while, Alex. To be fair. Um, I, I didn't want to mention it, but uh, real through from you. Just obviously, you've, you've mentioned Sean coming off there. Is, is he okay? Um, uh, uh, we need to him? assess him. Uh, he will see the physio. Uh, hopefully, we'll see what he's like on Tuesday. Uh, but. He said when he got fouled right at the end of the first half, he, he got his ankle caught and he, straight away you know, he had a strange feeling in his leg. So we took him out as a precaution. He's walking around OK, but like I say, he needs to be assessed by the physio and sorted out properly. Uh, another goal from the back line with Brad's first, first one from Brad. Um, I feel like I ask you every other week how important it is from goals from all over the pitch. So how important is it from goals all yeah, over the pitch? Huge, it's huge to score uh, again to get ourselves in front. Uh, so that's the first time we scored two goals in a while. Uh, but you know, Willow's set plays today were very good. Uh, they were back to where he has been before. And first contact with Matty, I think he's kind of over it at the first post. And Brad's contact is really good and clean at the in the middle of the goal. And like I say, it's already deserved. And when you get to 90 minutes, uh, results previously have been a little bit panicky. Uh, but to get the goal in the 92nd minute was uh, really thoroughly deserved, and we're really pleased. Absolutely. And then um, a special shout out to Kieran Wells as well, who was brought in less than 24 hours ago. He played the full 90 minutes and was simply outstanding today. Um, how important is it what he offers on the top of the pitch and how does it differ from the other players that we've got uh, in uh, that position? He's, I think I called him prehistoric man inside. Uh, he's a throwback. Um, you know, he's something different that we haven't had for a while. Um, Kieran is heart on his sleeve. Uh, he's loud, he's boisterous, he looks for people up the wrong way, but every team needs, what, every team needs a Kieran Wells. And today I didn't think he'd get through 90, in all honesty. I think adrenaline's got him through it. I think he'll hurt tomorrow, uh, but I think he'll wake up tomorrow morning still smiling. I think so will we all. Merry Christmas, Steve. Thanks, Alex. Thank you, sir.